Hi everyone, this is Tim Vetter with the Fiat Chrysler Automotive Group. I have some recap software registration best practices to share. Thanks for watching. Two goals will be to verify the quality of a standard cloud to cloud project using targets and then how to enhance the cloud to cloud registration using targets. In this example, VCAT processed seven scans and created two groups. If you look at the two groups that were created in this new project, uh, group one has numbers here that look pretty good. And then if I switch to group two, uh, and if you look here, um, a lot of good overlap, good balance, good points. Uh, unfortunately, um, when you look at the scan locations, they should be in a numerical order. Here's scan three, four, six, seven, and there's five. They're all over the place. To fix this issue, um, if I needed to break up the scan on the left, I can remove scans by simply hitting this X. Over here, knowing how bad the group of five is, I'm going to disband the whole group. Say OK. And they'll all go into a independent area where I have to regroup each one manually. In the seven scan project, we have the resulting cloud to cloud registration results. Next step is to verify this project using targets. I'm going to take this registration work up to the main floor of our stamping plant and I'm going to show you current project basically in process where I have five groups. Group number one has been pulled together and is target verified. You'll, you'll notice that I the group gives me a RMS noise value if I did target enhancement of 0.34 it's very tempting to want to hit this button and enhance this group, but don't do it because you're going to create some issues uh, with other groups when you start working with them. So hold off on that. So you know it is still cloud to cloud because I do not have an RMS value here. Also, you'll see that I have registration data shown here. Uh, you will see that you also know it is cloud to cloud because in the cur this current version of Recap, 2020.1 there's no RMS information for the scans and there's no reason why they can't provide this the competitive software does include uh, this value which helps you understand the positions of each scan cloud to cloud so you have no way to verify that unless you use targets so currently I have used targets to verify this group everything looks good here let's move on to group two Group two, I have successfully put together the cloud to cloud work. Uh, if you look at the registration reporting, you'll see that I have mediocre values here. They're all yellow. Uh, if I look at the target information, you'll see that I've got target verified cloud to cloud. You know it's cloud to cloud because again, overall RMS is zero. And I have information here for registration under target and with the scans notice nothing here for scan data so that these are the indications that you are still in a cloud to cloud mode for that group we're going to go to group number three and with group number three you'll notice that not all of the scans are green because i started to incur target computation error uh, it's a software bug when you select your target You'll notice, oh, in this case, it did accept it. That's good. Let's find out what's going on here. I know this one should be five. It selects that. Let's see what we get here. Okay, so what you're seeing in here is it's telling you that it's co completely horrible and bad. Um, typically, it won't even recognize or automatically give you the information as to what target it is. And, uh, it, it automatically told me it was five or six. It won't even do that most of the time. So I'm going to show you the steps to fix this. 
you're going to just simply suspend your project. You're going to reopen it, resume registration. You'll go back to number three. You want to look at the targets, go to target data, and you'll see that all of my targets now look good. So bottom line is the way to avoid this because it can be very frustrating and troubling to try to select all your targets. You have to do the whole project cloud to cloud. You can't verify cloud to cloud until you get all of your scans pulled together. Then you can go in and just start selecting your targets at the end of the workflow. Uh, that's the only way I have found to get around this bug. Fast forward, I now have all five groups pulled together into one cloud to cloud project. The issue that was shown earlier in this video is now resolved. What you'll notice is there's no longer, there's a bunch of green items here obviously because uh, those were had matching targets, but now everything is in one column where we have now a lot of others that are not matching. If I scroll down, you'll see where we left off before and 37 where we were having the issue. I now started matching scans, everything's matching. Uh, when I look at the reporting, every time I select a new target, I'm getting nice numbers. Uh, so the issue's resolved. What I will be doing at this point is selecting targets throughout everything after they're all green I hit one time enhancement and it will enhance the whole project I am now at the point where I have selected three matching targets in every scan and you'll notice that everything is green here as long as this part is highlighted target enhancement value looks like it's going to be 0.48 Nine, nine. I just got under that 0.5 threshold uh, but before I do the target enhancement I'm going to back up my work. Okay the backup is complete. I'm going to go ahead and do my target enhancement. Click the easy button. You'll see the cloud to cloud and registration data on the left and you'll see what the resulting target enhanced registration looks like on the right. I'll go ahead and complete that task. This goes remarkably fast by the way so I'm just gonna let it run. Go to the project. Okay everything's complete. Let's check out the report. I now know that this is a target enhanced registration. You'll notice nothing here for registration data under target data. I now have an overall RMS displayed. All of my targets are uh, pretty decent. Some of them are a little high here. As you see, um, individual targets, the worst one is 1.2. Um, I now have scan locations with an RMS noise. You only get this when you do target enhancement. You do not get this with cloud to cloud registrations. I want to thank you for watching this video where the next step is entering surveyed monuments or if surveyed monuments are not available you'll be creating them using the virtual monuments creation workflow.